Hi! Welcome to Portal 7. In today's fast-paced digital world, PDFs have become the universal language for sharing documents, whether it's resumes, contracts, reports, or school assignments. But what happens when you need to make a quick edit, add a signature, or merge files on the go? That's where online PDF editors come in. No more downloading bulky software or struggling with formatting issues. With just a few clicks, you can edit, annotate, convert, and share your PDFs from anywhere, anytime. Whether you're a student, a professional, or just someone trying to stay organized, an online PDF editor is your secret weapon for productivity and convenience. In this video, we'll explore PDNob Online. PDNob Online is one of the best 100% truly free online PDF editor with no limitations, no watermarks, and no hidden paywalls. Unlike other online PDF editors such as Small PDF and I Love PDF, that is not just helpful, but essential in our increasingly paperless world. Let's dive in and discover how PDNob Online can transform the way we work with documents. PDNob Online link is in video's description you can just click on it and start. Click on Get Started. Here you can see its dashboard. You can access all features in just one click on main page. In left side, it has a toolbar for quick access for important features. Here important thing is that we don't need to register or sign in to access its features unlike other online PDF editors. First let's try OCR. Click on OCR. Now you can drag and drop any scanned image or you can locate its destination. I will upload an image from desktop. As you can see I have uploaded this scanned image. Now click on OCR PDF. Within few seconds it's ready to download. And here you can see output PDF. Now we can select this text and copy. On desktop I will create new text file. And paste. As you can see and compare text and PDF. With 100% accuracy scanned image text is now editable. You can click on start over and upload next image. Here I will click on home in toolbox. Now let's try merge PDF. From desktop I will select two PDF files to merge a single file. Once uploaded click on merge PDF. Within few seconds it's ready to download. And here you can see output PDF. Both PDFs are now one. You can also check single files each. Once again click on home. Now let's try convert options. Click on PDF to Word. Upload a PDF file. You can choose with OCR or no OCR. Here I will select with OCR. Click on convert to Word. Within few seconds PDF to Word file is ready. You can edit this in Word. Here you can compare PDF and Word file. Now click again on Home. This time click on Word to PDF. Upload Word file and click on Convert to PDF.
And here you can see result, Word to PDF file is ready. Now let's try Excel to PDF. Upload Excel file. Click on Convert to PDF. And you can check the output result. Here you can check original Excel sheet. Now let's try PDF to Excel. Upload any PDF file. You have option to choose with OCR and no OCR. You can also select data on one sheet or multiple sheet. Now click on Convert to Excel. And within few seconds Excel file is ready to download. Here you can see the result. Once again click on home and this time let's try image to PDF. Select multiple images and click on convert to PDF. Here you can see output result. Now click on PDF to image. Locate PDF file. Choose entire page or image only option. Choose image format and image quality. Now click on convert to image. Within few seconds it will convert PDF to image. Images will be downloaded in a zip file. Now click on home. And choose compress PDF. Locate a large size PDF that you want to compress in low size. Choose compression mode. Click on compress PDF. Now you can compare both file size. Compressed file is 30% less from original file. Quality is also same without losing any details. Now click on home and choose protect PDF. Locate any PDF file which you want password protect. Now set password.
you can set same password for batch files processing. Or you can choose different passwords for individual files. Now click on protect password. Within few seconds password protected file is ready. Enter password to open file. Now click on home and let's try e-sign. Click on PD knob sign. You can see instructions here to e-sign a document. Click on choose file. Locate a PDF file that requires signature from other person. Click next. Fill recipient fields. Enter mail ID. Enter message and click next. Drag and drop signature on the area where you want to get signature. Click on send. Here we have to log in because without any mail ID how a recipient will know about sender. Click on login. Click on sign in with Google. Enter mail ID. Enter password. Now click on send. Now click on back to home. Here you can see your e-signature platform. You can check your mail status here. As you can see one mail is waiting for signature here. That we just sent. Now I will open that mail where we sent mail for signature. Here this mail gives option to view and sign document. Now click on signature. Here you can see three type signature. In style, here is your name in different fonts. In draw option you can draw signature. In image option you can upload scanned image. Once signature is done click on finish. Now close it and come back to original sender. Refresh page. Now you can check on your e-signature platform. Signature status is now one completed. Now you can download and check signature on file. Here you can compare PD knob online features with other PDF editor brands. As you can see PD knob online is the best 100% truly free online PDF editor with no limitations, no watermarks and no hidden paywalls. If you have professional or offline needs, then you can also try PD knob's desktop tool. Tenor share PD knob for Windows and Mac. This link is also in video's description. To see more videos like this. Please consider subscribing. Thanks for watching.